Hola YouTube, how are you doing? So you put some DVD into your MacBook and in fact you cannot get it out anymore. The thing is stuck and every time you boot your machine you hear some clack 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 you know and you're pressing the EAT key with the hope that it's gonna come out but it does not come out. And the worst thing in my case is that the DVD is also not showing any information. How did it happen? Well, I was having a problem with my Mac and in fact this had to be some repair method. This is a bootable DVD that I created and it has refit on it. Okay, but what really happened is the Mac was off. Okay, so you must really think about this, eh? because I think that that more people can get this 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 problem. Never stick in a DVD while turning on your Mac. First, turn on the Mac, even if the thing does not want to boot up. Turn it on, bam, you know, and then whatever it will show some screen that is not you know it's not booting. Then put in the DVD. Okay, don't turn it on and then press the DVD inside because in some way that brings an error into the into the DVD, the super drive. And that happened exactly to me because I wanted to boot from this, this CD. So I turned on the Mac bang, and I pushed in the DVD and of course the DVD, it, 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 took the, it took the CD but in some way something went wrong and the dvd you know uh, probably it never re uh, uh, recognized the, the 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 boot because yeah I, maybe maybe this this cd is not working i'm not even sure so but it's supposed to work so i'm gonna test it on 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 another machine although this is for mac so it will have to be another mac with a more reliable uh, uh how you say that um yeah super drive because yeah my my thing was stuck so i'm going to show you how to fix it and how you can uh, force remove the stock dvd or cd out of the super drive from your macbook so how to get it out well of course you can try with some knife but i would not do that or with some maybe some screwdriver and but I would also not do that. What you should do is, if in your case the DVD is still showing, you know, if you can see it in your computer environment, if it's popping up on your desktop, then of course you can try eject from there. You know, you can try eject, but most of the times you tried that already, right? And it's not working. So we can uh, also try to go into um itunes in itunes you will also find some eject button if you go on the controls you will find all the way down you will find eject okay but uh, i found an even better way and what you should do is go into the terminal open your terminal screen okay what you're gonna do is you're gonna fire up the terminal okay and you're gonna type drew till and then e eject you see that this is what you type listen you hear that so we're forcing the mechanism to eject whatever is in there one more time the command drew till eject and just you know um repeat the command as much as it takes to uh to fix it the problem but there is nothing in there so it won't uh, it won't react anymore i think brutal eject because there is nothing in there you see it's not uh, it's not uh, reacting anymore uh, but that's how to do it and what I did in my case, the first time it did not come out, and then I typed it again, drew till eject, and then I, before I hit it 
or while I pressed enter, I also hit it on here. And then the, the DVD came out just a little bit that I could pull it out. And that's how I removed my DVD from the stock super drive of my MacBook Pro 7.1. In my case, you know, it popped out just a little bit that I saw something, you know, like, so I grabbed it and I pulled it out. So I don't know what the problem is, but uh, I, I have this problem uh, more often. My, my previous MacBook uh, DVD was also not working. It, it only worked once, I think, when I, when I just got it. And after that, it's like these DVDs uh, players, they don't like uh, burn, burn CDs. I don't know. Or they, don't, they just don't like. I don't know. I don't know what it is. I always have problems with these things and I can never, you know, in a normal way get these. Probably my Mac is way too old and that's why this is happening. But then again, I have a compact from 25 years old and that thing, Ajax still works fine because Ajax has nothing to do with, you know, some terminal that you, you know, it could be as well. You have comments for that, but you also have a button at the outside that you can press and then the whole thing comes out. So, yeah, I'm used to affect these things. And, and on my Mac, I always have a problem with, with, with DVDs and CDs. So that's how to fix the problem. Uh, let me know in the comments if this helped, of course, because I want you to to fix your problem I, I think it's nothing is more annoying than having some dvd stuck in your in your macbook and you can't get it out um i'm sure that now you got it out and if you really cannot get it out really 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 then probably um you will have to open the macbook and and find another way because then something is wrong with the mechanism of, of 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 the dvd and that can also be the case at a certain moment these things they just they just fail. So that's it. Uh, that's how I fixed my uh, stuck DVD. I hope you will fix yours as well. If this helped, of course, leave this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you did not already. And of course, check out one of my 2K videos. I have over 2000 videos here on my channel. So go check out what really interests you. And uh, of course, always reply to me, leave me a comment. Always nice to receive something from you all out there. Thanks for watching. Until my next video, doei!